got straight up west south road here. So I'm back at home. Uh, no, I didn't catch anything. Yes, I marked some fish. I think I had one bite and I missed it. So I just weren't biting today. I asked a few people out there and they said they didn't have that much luck either. They were just marking a lot. So that seems like that's how it was tonight. But uh. I was using live minnows, I was using jigs, I was using everything that I know that produces fish. I just couldn't get them to bite, so. Um, and that's the thing about Cherry Creek, for those of you that are in Colorado and um, thinking about fishing Cherry Creek or whatever. Um, unless you have a camera, it's hard to tell what's on your, uh, your fish finder or your Vexlar or whatever you have. Um... Because there is a lot of shad in there, there's a lot of carp in there, um, you know, stuff like that. So, I mean, I've caught shad out there that are like 16 inches long. So, I mean, you know, when when you see that on a uh, on a Vexlar, it looks like a big fish. So, um, yeah, and there's a lot of carp in there as well. So, um, but there's walleye in there. There's some really decent crappie in there. Uh, there's wiper in there, there's catfish in there, there's bluegills in there. I don't think there's, I mean, there used to be perch in there. I haven't caught a perch out of there for probably 15 years now, so. Um, but, yeah, I mean, it is possible to catch walleye out there. I have done it in the past, I just, I haven't done it. I haven't done it this year yet, so. Um, but 2021's coming, so hopefully it's going to be a better year. Alright, Straight Up West out.